In this video, we are going to be looking at enzymes, what they are, and what do they do. By the end of class, you'll be able to answer these questions and then some. Enzymes are mainly proteins that are made up of, of, of amino acids. Every living thing or organism has enzymes in them. Enzymes help reactions in organisms to happen faster. Without enzymes, your reactions would still happen, but would do so at a much slower pace. Let's look a little closer at what makes an enzyme an enzyme. As I mentioned before, enzymes for the most part are proteins that are made up of amino acids. It is the amino acids that give the enzyme its shape and function. Once an enzyme is made, it is assigned a specific job. The main function of all enzymes is to bring reactants or substrates into contact with each other so less energy is needed for reactions to occur. Because the energy of activation or the amount of energy that is required to start a reaction is lowered by enzymes, less energy is needed for the reactions to occur. So more reactions can happen at a faster rate. Now that we know what an enzyme's job is, let's talk about how it, is, how it does its job. All enzymes have an active site or a place where a substrate binds. Each active site has a certain shape that matches up to the specific substrate it is helping, like a lock and key. Once the substrates have found their active site on the enzyme, the molecules complete their reaction and the products are released. Keep in mind that the reaction doesn't consume or use up the enzyme, and it doesn't change its shape. You might not know it, but enzymes are at work in your own home. The detergent used to get stains out of your clothes has enzymes in them. This is just one example. There are factors that can affect how an enzyme works. Because enzymes are sensitive to its surroundings, it is easy for it to stop working or to become denatured. If the pH changes or if the salt level becomes too high or too low, enzymes can become denatured. Temperature also has a big impact on how well enzymes work. For temperature drops, the reaction takes longer to happen. Enzymes actions increase as temperature increases, but if the temperature gets too hot, the enzymes become denatured. Lactose intolerance is an example of how a denatured enzyme or missing enzymes can affect a person. People whose intestinal cells don't have enzymes called lactase can't digest milk sugar, known as lactose. So we learned today that enzymes act as a catalyst and are proteins made up of amino acids arranged into 3D shapes, which have surfaces or grooves called active sites, the, which bind substrates and convert them into products. You'll be able to access this lecture on the 9th grade biology CAVB.